Hello, my name is Chris. This video tutorial will go over the concept of dynamic routing and convergence. Dynamic routing is much more scalable than static routing. A growing network does not pose a big problem with dynamic routing protocols. The administrator has less work in maintaining the configuration when adding or deleting networks, since the protocol automatically reacts to a network topology changes. Convergence is when the routing table of all routers are at the state of convergency. When all routers have completed and accurate information about the network and is set to have converged. By the time this video tutorial is over, you will know how to add a new LAN to an existing topology, advertise the newly added network, and determine if the network has converged with debugging outputs. Okay, let's start. In the interest of time, we will base the tutorial off packet tracer exercise E2-325. Begin by going to the device area at the bottom and choosing a switch. Click on the 2960 switch and place it in the workplace. Then click on connections at the bottom and choose copper straight through. Click switch to and cable fast ethernet 0 slash 1 interface to router 3's fast ethernet 0 slash 1 interface. Next, click on end devices at the bottom and choose connect and choose generic PCs. Place it in the workplace and cable it to switch to fast ethernet 0 slash 2. Now, configure Router 3's Fast Ethernet 0 slash 1 by clicking Router 3 and clicking the CLI tab. Hit Enter. And we're going to type in Enable. To enter in Privilege Exec Mode and then type in Config T to enter global configuration mode. Enter in int fa slash 1. To access the fast ethernet 0 slash 1 interface, we're going to enter in IP address 12.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.
directly connected networks in one network, dynamically discovered by RIP. Enable debugging for the RIP protocol on router 3 by entering debug IP RIP. Occasional messages will appear updating the status of currently discovered networks. To keep these messages from interfering with your typing, enter in config t line con 0, then logging synchronous. Now let's advertise the newly added network. Enter global config mode on router 3. Then enter router rip. And then network 12.0.0.0. Enter. Next, observe the debugging output for the router. The network should have now converged. You can check this by first disabling debugging on the router by entering no debug IP rip. Verify the routing table by pinging PC0 from PC2. Ping 10.0.2 and press enter. There we go, that's a good sign. And then we're going to exit and we're going to ping PC2 from PC0. Twelve dot two five five dot two five five dot two five four. The ping should be successful. Done. You have now successfully completed this packet tracer tutorial. Thanks for watching.